Type the letter H on your workspace. Now, go ahead and change its color to make it more visible. Next, select the contour tool and then drag it carefully in this direction to create a nice layered effect. After that, right-click on the black color and choose Break Apart to separate the contour. Now, change its color again to match your desired style. Then, select the Extrude tool and extrude it just like this to give it a 3D look. From the Extrude Type options, select this particular style, which gives a smooth and dynamic appearance. Now, adjust it slightly until it looks perfect. After that, right-click on the side of it and choose Break Apart once again. Then, right-click and select All Ungroup to separate all the elements. Now, select everything together and weld them into a single shape. Once done, change its color again to make it stand out. Next, select this H and group it to keep all parts together. Then, using the Shadow tool, add a light shadow to the H for a more stylish effect. Now, reduce the feathering of the shadow slightly to keep it clean. After that, select the purple color and add a white outline around it. Set the thickness of this outline to two points for a neat border. Now, copy this purple color and scroll down the page. Then, remove its fill color so it's just an outline. Go to the Object menu and choose Convert to Object. Then, convert this one to an object as well. Now, apply a black color to it to make the contrast clear. You can also change its color again if you want a different look. Next, select the Blend tool and blend both of these shapes together smoothly. After blending, bring both of them forward by pressing Page Up. Now, add a white outline to them again. Make sure the outline thickness is set to two points for consistency. Then, select all of them together and group them neatly. After that, Select the Shadow tool once again, and add a soft shadow to the entire text. Now, reduce the feathering, but increase the opacity to make the shadow more visible and bold. Finally, select everything and group it all together one last time. And that's it, your comic style text is ready. If you liked this tutorial, please make sure to subscribe for more awesome design videos.